It is Friday, so you know what that means. We have another Bill's Basement to show off. Hope Winter shows us a Bill's Basement from a member of the Buffalo Sports Hall of Fame that feels more like a museum. So it means a lot. It does. It, there's a lot of civic pride you know, when you're talking Buffalo sports. From the War Memorial Stadium sign, a ticket from the very first Bills game, pieces of the odd, and even Norwood's jersey he wore during that wide right kick. If you're looking for an artifact of Buffalo sports, John Boutte might already have it on display. I've always saved everything. If I went to a game, I saved a ticket stub or the program. Or uh, my father would buy me a pennant at the, at the game and bring it home. So I would always save all those things. You know, I was never a person that would throw them out. So that's kind of how I got into it. His love of finding these treasures started when he collected baseball cards as a kid. More than 50 years later, he's finding historic valuables online, in antique shops, garage and estate sales, and even just by word of mouth. He says his basement has something from every Buffalo team in history. History is, is very important in our society in general and uh, in Buffalo, especially with sports. It's so, it's so important to us that, you know, we shouldn't forget the past. And I would love to have a, a Buffalo Sports Museum dedicated to just the history of Buffalo sports. And I've tried to do that here. When you walk through John's museum located here in his basement, everywhere you look, you see a piece of Buffalo sports history. And with every artifact comes a story that John loves to tell. So I'm a teacher and it kind of ties into what I do for a living. I think it's important to teach people of today the past and where it came from. He believes for a city that's known for their love of sports. Buffalo's in need for a public Buffalo Sports History Museum for everyone to come out and learn. And I think most Bills fans don't realize some of the stories we've told about the different colors, about their first game, where they came from. American Football League. So I think it's important that, that that gets passed on to new generations. But for now, if you're interested in learning more about his collection and Buffalo sports history piece by piece, you might find his book, Buffalo's Got the Spirit, collecting Buffalo sports history in a local library. In Grand Island, Hope Winter, News 4.